Hi everybody, I'm John Elliston from the Mountain Express and I'm here with your sneak peek at the upcoming issue of the newspaper which comes out on Wednesday. Today we're at Enviro Depot, the toy store in downtown Asheville. With me is Rebecca Bow. Hi Rebecca. Hi John. Rebecca just returned from Alaska to tell a fascinating and troubling story about what she found there. Tell us, Rebecca, what were you doing in Alaska? Well, John, I was there to see the on-the-ground effects of climate change in Alaska. And what kind of things did you see? Well, there are a lot of melting glaciers. I got to go on a boat tour and see a glacier melting right before my eyes. Well, that's got to be hard to watch. Is there anything we should uh, be worried about in western North Carolina when it comes to climate change? Yeah, well, it turns out that the effects of climate change are going to happen in western North Carolina, too. Scientists are even saying that by 2100, it could be as hot as Atlanta here. Oh, no. Well, thank you, Rebecca, for preparing the article. We look forward to reading it on Wednesday. Also in the Express this week, a detailed story on the water agreement lawsuit, the latest on Asheville City Council, how local groups are aiding in hurricane relief down in the Gulf area, a complete report about Brewgrass, the beer festival that returns to Asheville, uh, Q&A with Mark Strand, the Pulitzer Prize winning poet. Also an article on the Belleville outfit, which will be returning to Asheville to play two shows. Plus we'll have Ken, Cranky Hanky's movie reviews, Edgy Mama's column, and much, much more. We'll see you on Wednesday. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.